Hey guys, my name is Scoby and welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to move the installations of your creative cloud applications. This is going to be a nice, quick and easy tutorial. I'm going to be showing you step by step how to do everything. Let's jump right into this. So the first thing you need to do is, of course, open up your creative cloud application. We're simply going to be opening it up and you're going to need to be logged into your account. From this point, we can currently see all of the apps that we have installed. Now, sadly, in Creative Cloud, there is no way to actually just move our application from one location to another. Instead, we actually need to change our full install folder for the entire Creative Cloud suite. To do this, what we need to do is click on the File button here on the top left of our Creative Cloud. We're going to be coming to our Preferences folder, or you can use the shortcut Control and Plus. From this point, it will bring us to the General tab. But what we're going to be doing is coming here to the left. We're going to be clicking on the Application option right here. From this point, we're going to be scrolling down and we're going to be looking for the installing option. And then right here, we should see the install location. And by default, it will have the default location selected. If you would like to change this, we can simply click the pencil on the right. It will open up this pop-up window. And here we can choose where we want to install our Creative Cloud applications. So what I'm going to be doing is coming to my C drive and I'm going to be making a new folder here called New Adobe. Simply going to be putting it here. I'm going to be double clicking to open this up. We're going to be clicking Select Folder. And what it's going to do now is change our Install Location folder. You can see the success message right here. And it's going to be loading all of our applications. Now, once this has been updated, we'll be brought back to our normal Adobe screen. However, if we locate to this new folder that we created and we have set up, we will see the new Adobe folder right here. There's actually no applications currently installed here. And that's because what we've just done, as mentioned at the start of the video, does not actually change the currently installed applications. From this point, if you'd like to move any applications, you first need to uninstall the application. So I'm going to be doing this with Adobe Audition as an example. So I'm going to uninstall it first. So you need to come to the app you want. We're going to be clicking on the three dots and we're going to be clicking uninstall. Here you can choose to keep your preferences if you want. I'm going to be keeping my preferences, but you can set this up however you want. Once this is done, we're then going to be looking for this application that you've just uninstalled. So I'm going to be searching for Audition again. I can see it right here underneath my apps. You can also search in the Creative Cloud, whatever is easier for you. From this point, I'm simply going to be clicking Install. And then my app is going to re-download. And once it's fully downloaded, it should be brought to the new location rather than the previous location we had set up. Once your app is fully installed, you should get the success message here. It should say fully up to date. And now when we come to our new Adobe folder, we should see our application is currently here. We can see our file folder here with Adobe Audition and all of the applications files are currently installed here and just like that you can update and move adobe apps from one location to another i want to take this moment to give a huge shout out to the channel members sean daly Ira, and joshua davis thank you guys so much for supporting the channel i really appreciate it if you'd like to have your name shout out in future videos or some other perks be sure to click the join button underneath any video on the channel it would really help me out anyway guys thank you so much for watching if you enjoyed this video be sure to drop a like Subscribe if you're new, check out the other videos on the channel. If you want to support me, be sure to drop a super thanks in this video. I'd greatly appreciate it. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. Until next time, as always, keep it saucy. Peace.